Welcome back to some Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories. Um, uh, real quick, I'm just gonna frickin... Do something on Neverland because I accidentally reround time a bit here. So I'm just gonna have to beat Captain Hook again, which might be a little bit annoying. But, thankfully there isn't really any rooms left to go to anyway, so... What the hell did- what did that give me? So, yeah, I'll just have to- no. I don't want that. No, bro. It gives me the most mint treasure. Imagine, bro, a freaking level 2 kingdom key. That's- none of these are even- they're all level 2. Also- Oh, a zero fairy art. That's not too bad, actually. Okay, I can I can live with that. Okay, now I'll have to just arrange my decks because summons won't be helpful against Hook. And um, Bambi wasn't helpful. I forget what I did, honestly. So yeah, I'm just doing this little mini so here, and then we'll get the real meat out of the way. Oh yeah. Why don't I use one of these enemy cards? No, the freaking cost is probably why, but... Yeah, that sounds good, actually. Let's use it! Mm -hmm. Mint. Okay, wow, that's perfect. Oh wait, this is even, not even the right deck that I'm using. That other deck is icky, why do I have it equipped? Oh, same ration still applies. Cloud isn't gonna cut it at the moment here. Okay, um. Wow, that saves a lot of space actually. I can just get more keys. I'm gonna need those high numbers. sound like a pretty good card, honestly. The health is good, but, like, it doesn't really heal that much. So, I don't know how I feel about it. Damn, okay, I still have to get rid of something here. Well, honestly, not really using magic too much against him, so let's just keep the standard, you know, magic cards here. I don't mind, it's a little bit of a challenge, but, you know, Hulk was just mostly kind of skill anyway. So I'm ready to do the challenge again. 
kind of. Actually, not really ready, but... Why is it letting me... Oh, wait, that's why. I finally have another zero card that isn't just a freaking kingdom key. So that's good. That should do it. Alright. Got all these freaking bargain bin cards over here. Okay. We're gonna kill him easily. Perhaps. I, I don't know, actually. Ah, uh, crap, I should add a cure. Okay, I remember what, uh, what else I did. I added a cure. Other than the freaking zero I have, because it isn't always going to work. Fair enough. Supremus, how you doing? I was just arranging my deck. I kill this guy, so that's a thing. I gotta beat Captain Hook again because I accidentally used my card. I mean, that card. Uh, what am I saying? Accidentally uh, did something. Oh, wait. He's not even here yet. Wait, where am I? Oh, I still have to do these rooms. Damn it. Well, I'll still keep this deck equipped anyway. It shouldn't do me harm. It'll have me ready for the fight ahead. I'm a Kingdom Hearts hat, which is relevant to the stream, so I'm wearing this. Yeah, didn't get a chance to ask it, but I'm sure there's one somewhere. I'll have to use that on the next Mario Kart stream. Okay, which card am I going to use here? Yeah, sure. You know what? Tranquil. I'm just gonna spam slate until like beat all these freaking enemies. Doesn't matter what I do. Just like Castle of Oblivion, this freaking stream will just kind of disappear after it's done, since it's a mini zone, which has no stake.
Oh, bruh. RNG giving me good cards anyway. So, you know, this episode isn't for nothing. I mean, I got a couple better cards than I did last time. Oh, bruh. I have to level up again. I always forget what I have to do next with the level up. Now I, whenever I come back to this game, I forget how fun I have, how much fun I have playing it. So it's all good. I don't mind. And I like how that stuff the smash combo. Um. Okay. I'm just gonna do CP. That seems fair enough to me. To uh, upgrade next. the treasure card? Oh yeah, I do. Good. You know, I could have done this yesterday, but whatever. More treasure. Ow, that's gross. Sure, you know what? Very hard. Zero. I'll go with that.
Oh, right, I forgot the cliffhanger on this episode was that I couldn't freaking access this room. Because there's no blue card here. But, I'll be back later to get my treasure. Smash Flash 2, he's, um, they, they use the freaking Kingdom Hearts 2 voice, where he's, like, sounds a lot older than freaking Kingdom Hearts 1, because he's, like, I don't know, he's, like, 13, and they voice Kingdom Hearts 1, I believe, something like that, maybe younger, maybe a little older, and then in Kingdom Hearts 2, he's, like, 16 or 17, so he just sounds immediately like he's super older. And in the remake of this game on PS2, it's even more jarring because it's Kingdom Hearts 1 Sora, but he still ca he still sounds like Sora from Kingdom Hearts 2 because he's older, and that game came out in 2007, so, um, I don't know. It just, it's jarring when you jump from Kingdom Hearts 1 to the remake of this on PlayStation 2. Anyway, yeah, this is Baby Boy Sora, so he sounds funny. I like him. He's a little he's a little creature. We love him. And yeah, I'm kinda used to older Sora too. His voice too in the other games, but um 
I like the Kingdom Hearts 1 iteration of the same voice actor, too. You know, wholesome beginning. He's, he's a small boy in that game. Okay, um, CP. I'm just gonna try to, like, true balance it out. Oh, gosh. Come on. I gotta get through all these enemies. But, uh... I mean, it's so good to do a little mini-stream for the first part of this. I mean, I call it mini-stream, but that's only because I want to separate the parts of the actual progress on the next part. Because, like, I loaded a safe state, so... By accident, while I was trying to get mood dialysis. Aliases. So, um... Yeah, that, that was an oopsie. Messed up a little bit. But, thankfully, it only sent me back by like 20 minutes or something. Now I'm already back at the boss of this world, and then that'll be it for that. Um, save it. Just, just keep saving. Oh, crap. I don't want to use the premium card. I hate it that much. No, no more treasure. However, we can use false bounty. I don't have to use six, but I like matching the numbers, so. And I'm gonna add the other zero here. Zeros are good. Damn. Yeah, I'm gonna add and remove some of these cards. I don't need a five. And I don't need this. And, well, you know, arguably I don't need this. Damn it. Okay, um... There. Crud, I only have 20 attack cards. Okay. Well, it's all good. Anyway, for those who don't know how this game works, basically... The higher value you have, the more chance you have of breaking your opponent's attacks, because, like... Basically, your opponent can break your attack if they have a knight higher number. So it's kind of like the regular Kingdom Hearts gameplay, but with a twist. So it feels quite different. And if you pull a zero, it's basically like, you can break any card with it, but if... Another character, I mean, another enemy uses that card first on you, then, um, they break your attack. So you have to use the zero after they do their attack. It's kind of like a counter. It's pretty cool. I like the gameplay here, even if it can be a little bit flawed in areas at times. Like, the card system is kind of cool. I like it. Definitely the most different Kingdom Hearts game, in terms of the gameplay. Most of them are kind of basically like the main series. But this one is quite different. I'm gonna take this off for now. Screw it. Also, man, the lighting in here can suck sometimes. Anyway... <laughs> You know what? I don't need summons. I like attack cards more. Oh, we got Anomaly Goofy. <laughs> Oh, for a Thundo card. Probably not helpful, but let's see what it does. I like when I get enemy cards, even though I don't use them at all. 
Forfeit magic card and use to power up summon Kyle. Who would you want that? Sounds kind of use icky and useful. Gonna be honest. Boom. I like that attack. And if you position certain cards in a certain way in your deck, you can do full moves like the one I'm using. So that's neat. Kind of like the ability is in the other King Hearts games, except instead of just equipping them, you have to activate them by having cards. Just, you know, it'd be a bit too OP if you could just use the ability. Like in the other games, and also the GBA had limited buttons, so there wasn't really any good way to implement such a system on the handheld. Bro, there's so many of them. Donald. I love LeChonk, he's so fun. Making a goofy, I've been wa listening to the goofy movie soundtrack again. I forgot how, forgot how much the bangers in this movie that movie were. Got some good songs. Goofy movie. They, they gotta put it in Max and keep him hard. He's cool. Map field sprites for enemies don't even accurately represent which enemy you're actually gonna be fighting most of the time. Like, there's these freaking, like, the Rhapsody enemy, and you don't even see these enemies in this world, as far as I know. Like, I have not bought a single one of those guys in the actual battle. treasure thing, like, like, one chest is the right one. Okay, I know they actually, and a lot of other stuff probably does that. I just think of Mario 64. The one power star, where you, like, got the not get electrocuted.
Oh, the lag. I don't know what I mean by 5H. 5 heal card, maybe? Mayhap. But, if so, the number would have went down, though, wouldn't it? Donald's a good dealer in this game. I know the, the Donald healing memes are it's like, oh, Donald sucks at healing. Well, freaking customize him so he can heal you if you care so much about Donald being your healer. Like, it's not even that bad of a... It's not even that big of an issue. Just, just literally change his setting so he can heal you. Still issue. Maybe with the default, Donald doesn't always heal, but... Like, I don't know. Freaking Donald healing means. Okay. We swept the area. Wiped it clean. Now we're gonna beat this thing. Also, I don't need these at all, so. Okay, skip this cutscene. I've already done all this. Funny fast mode. Do, do, do. Um, this away. Great. No? Oh, God. Okay. There. I've already done all this, so I'm skipping the cutscenes, because I don't want to waste anyone's time. Basically, Peter Pan's kind of a dick, and wants to abandon Wendy, because he, he, he thinks Wendy will forget about him. If she, she leaves Neverland, so he doesn't want her to leave home or something. Like, okay. I don't know, I feel like, in, out of all the cage games, he's the most jerkish in this one. Even though he's not real, technically, but, you know, you know, logic. Like, don't just trap her in this world she didn't, she doesn't even live in, come on, man. She doesn't even live in Neverland. This is not her home. Okay, we're gonna kill Captain Hook, again. Okay, that wasn't a good start. Okay, I forgot how much he kicked my ass. Peter Pan! Use your combo thing, so I can break off. Okay, whatever. I used it at a bad time, apparently. Oh. 
bro, you keep breaking my heels. Ouch. Okay, um... Maybe I need a slightly better deck? Yeah, that, that damage half card doesn't really help that much. If I'm gonna have a card, I, I want one that heals me. Preferably. And plus, I can equip more cards if I use Oogie. Or to have that's smaller than freaking ten? Probably not. Yeah, I don't think I have anything that would use less card points. Yeah, all these are useless. Well, not useless, but it's it's all good. Anyway, we're gonna be Captain Hook. No, 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 Ridiculous. 
Captain Hook, like, killed me, like, at least seven times or six times on the last stream. I mean, it was pretty, it was a lot stronger than I thought. Okay, HP. Okay, blah, 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 to talk about, uh, like, Wendy would never forget Peter Pan, even if she leaves Peter Pan, blah, 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 then they're friends again, stuff. I put more effort into reading it, but, you know, been there, done that. Oh, um, how do I leave? Oh, right here. All right, um, I'm gonna be right back. But if you enjoyed your this mini sode feel free to check out the next full episode, which is going on in momentarily, in a minute. So, uh, yeah, just bear with me for a second here. I'm just ending the part. Well, sorry for that. That was loud sound. 